Now, unfortunately, you can't do this with, like, every single wall in the game. Uh, just certain walls. It would be cool if you could just break every single thing in this game. But alas, you cannot. Why can't I grapple up there? Uh, that is weird. I don't know why I cannot grapple up there, so we will just glide in. Nope, Batman is not being responsive right now. What a jerk. Nothing is going my way right now. Batman just dies the minute he enters here. Because that's my luck. Am I supposed to be able to get the- yep. I'm supposed to t uh, take the Batmobile in here. I completely forgot. <laughs> Look at these guys. These guys are just all still here. That's great. Stop turning. What do you think they're planning? First stuff, Barbara. Bad stuff. I like how my Batman is just an idiot, apparently. Oof. I like how it says air control, but you really don't have much control in the air. Yeah, this is why you want to bring the Batmobile in here. You could just probably go on foot as Batman, but you're going to have to deal with these tanks somehow. And uh, Batman really isn't equipped to take on a tank on his own. Or is he? The twist actually at the end of this game is that Batman was actually Superman the whole time. Batman, I think I found a weakness in those drone tanks. The soldiers are covered by that sentry gun. I'll have to take them out quickly to avoid detection. Hey Batman, what are you up to? Oh, you know Barbara. Just venting. I'm gonna wanna quickly go behind this guy, because that is in fact a machine gun. Batman, we made it back to the precinct. God knows how. There are tanks everywhere. The bastards must have been planning this for weeks. Dig in and do what you can, Jim. I'll deal with them as soon as I've stopped the explosion. We're all counting on you, Batman. We'll get through this, I know we will. You're probably planning it for more than just weeks, Gordon. I would say Scarecrow's probably been planning this since Arkham Asylum. I need to get the car into this area before I can use it. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do, Batman. Doesn't make any goddamn sense. Ooh. Oh, this gonna be good. That's not quite what I wanted, but okay. Uh, those you get, those, like, little environmental takedowns you get if you, um... If you're near a blue item and then the person is also blue, then you can, in fact, take them down. Which is pretty great. Oh, wait, let me get this guy out of the way. Why can't I go... There we go. Nope. You too, bud. God damn it. Alright, well, at least I can do this. Someone get over by this little vent thing, please. Fuck yourself, sir. Please go for a, a white guy. Nope. Again, medics are the things you want to take out first. This guy's in prime spot. And I got the other guy. Oh. 
He's just in the corner chilling. He don't care. That was a damn good fight. That's why I love fighting so many people at once in this in this series. Based on the mixing chamber capacity, he's not bluffing, Bruce. I guess now we know why he evacuated the city. He needed control of the plant. Only Ace Chemicals has the facilities to build a bomb of this size. The fallout will be huge. We played right into his hands. He didn't care if everyone ran. He knew that no one would be able to escape the blast radius. I need to get the car into this area. Another goddamn fucking gate. This is like really annoying. You couldn't have gotten up there if it wasn't for the, the Batmobile glide thing. Gentlemen, tonight is the night that Gotham changes forever. The night it becomes a wasteland of nightmares. A forsaken symbol of Batman's failure. A monument to fear. But more than that, we're about to turn Gotham into the epicenter of a blast that will transform the entire eastern coast of America into my domain. Not what I wanted. I need to... Chemicals being loaded into the mixing chamber. Once I clear the room, I can focus on stopping the explosion. I think they, they finally made the um, explosive gel good again. Because in Origins, it sucked. It didn't knock anyone out. At least I'm pretty sure. Like, this guy's about to fucking get it. Yes, he was knocked out. In Origins, it doesn't work like that. Wait, hold on. That's probably what I want to do. I do like these little, like, shoot things. They're, they're very convenient. It's not something that you would ever think of, like, you know, oh, I hope they add this in the next game, but it's here and it's very, um, welcome, I think. Oh, that guy almost saw me, like, totally... Oh, fuck me. Does that guy see me? I need to get out of here. God, seriously, this it just makes you feel so much like Batman. You get really into it. At least I do. Oh, there's a guy there. Probably not my greatest moment. Any guys around here? Yeah, I can get that guy. Hello! How was I supposed to know that guy was gonna turn around? I had to be done, because apparently in the past year I've always got to make a, a dark side filled joke at least once per Let's Play. No, Batman. Uh, no, I don't have a, the ability for a double fear takedown right now. Oh, these are the only two guys. So I'm just going to take this guy down, corner cover the other guy. There's nothing he could do? The game is making dark side filled jokes for me now. Where'd that other fucker go? Where'd he go? The hell? Wow, he made it far. Um, let's see what can be be used right now. Let me just lure him over to me. I oh, know he's gonna come by himself. Cool. Complete that task and pray that you will not experience my fear. Fuck that guy in particular. The people of Gotham can run all they like, but they will not avoid their fate. Of chemicals and stuff, which can 
only mean that you are here, Batman. I've been looking forward to seeing you again. That's weird, I thought he said something else there. I could have sworn he said something like, Come in, Batman, the door is open. Which is a little silly, but hey. Do I need to do something with the Batmobile? No, I guess not. Do you really think you've won? Fear makes you predictable. I am in complete control. How do I shut it down? Let me go, or she dies. What are you talking about? Barbara Gordon. Have you found him? Get out of there, now! Relax. No one knows I'm here. Nothing hurts like losing one of the family, knowing that there is no one to blame but yourself. So this part's actually pretty annoying. Alfred. I heard what that maniac said to you, sir. I've been trying to contact Miss Gordon, unfortunately with no success. Keep trying. Warning. I can close the him. So we're gonna try and get a neutralizing agent going on here, but like I said, this uh, this part's not great. Thankfully, there's a payoff to this scene, which is great. But I can reduce the blast radius. And what will happen to you? That doesn't matter. Find her, Alfred. You can hear Batman typing over the Dual Shock, which is kind of neat. So this is really tedious and annoying. These canisters are highly volatile. I'm going to have to move slowly. Be very careful. He means Sir, that you I really need to do this like super slowly. Like, now. if you try and do it really fast, it doesn't really work out all that great. There's no other way, Alfred. Although I actually There's did it really fast away, there, Please. and it didn't seem like anything really happened. The walking part is the worst. But yeah, even though this part gameplay-wise is really annoying, there's a payoff in the story that is just great. Like, just to reiterate right here, we have to do this four times. This is, I think, one of the low points in the series. This ain't great. Just go down. Come on. Even takes longer if you try and go faster somehow. Neutralizing agent deployed. Last radius reduced by 25%. Where is she, Alfred? I have no idea. It's my fault they took her. She was aware of the risks, Master Bruce. She'll be as angry as you are that she's allowed this to happen. I, I have to say, I do really love the guy who plays Alfred in these Sir, games. listen to me. Don't you see? This is what he wants. Without you, Gotham will be at his mercy. You cannot let him win. It's been the same guy since City, and he was. He, I really loved him in, in Origins, and he's damn great in this game too. He might actually be my favorite Alfred, and I know the the one from the animated series is so iconic, but I, I really like this guy. Oh my god, this is so ridiculous! And yeah, let me do that level up. Um. Actually, let's get something for the Batmobile. That's the wrong one. Just get some armor here. That's a good time to upgrade the Batmobile, right? As we're about to die. I'm monitoring that facility. You're out of time. I'm begging you, leave now. It's what you taught me. Do the right thing. That's all that matters. Master Bruce, I implore you. You must get out of there. If this is about Miss Gordon, you cannot blame yourself for what's happened. Save yourself before it's too late. Goodbye, Alfred. I don't know. I love this scene. It's really... Like, I got emotional the first time I played this. Because this is... 
this is the only way Batman would ever stop being Batman is if he died, <laughs> which is why I hate the Dark Knight Rises. Like this is, I think this would have been a fitting end for Batman, and you know he's he's the kind of guy that absolutely would go out in the line of of Batmaning. You know he's not stopping until he's dead. I love the the sad music that plays. I love the goodbye, Alfred. But as we go for the fourth one, we're about to get a great payoff to this fairly tedious gameplay bit. And anyone who's played this game knows exactly what's about to happen. If I was a dick, I would end the video here. Miss me. So now we are taking control of Commissioner Gordon for the first time, and I don't know why, you know, if anyone else sees this, let me know that I'm not crazy, but this area, just like the coloring and the kind of dilapidated look of it, it reminds me a lot of Batman Year Zero in the New 52. I don't know why, and I think the fact that we're playing as Gordon really makes that uh, even more apparent. But yeah, I wish we could play as Gordon in combat, that would be pretty great. But yeah, I don't know, it's just the coloring and everything, just the fact that it's all over overgrown and overrun and old right. looking, it How really reminds me of Year Zero. Which error. is a great story, by the way, and everyone should read it. Confirmed. Welcome, Commissioner Gordon. Unbelievable. And now we're in first person because why not? There's a little Easter egg for the animated series, the gr the Grey Ghost, or the Ghost in Grey. Got the Flying Graysons. They're all dead now. The Prosecutor. I don't know what that's supposed to be. That might be an Easter egg for something I just don't, like, know. I think this one's Basil Carlo, yeah. So, neat little Easter eggs in that, that, uh, elevator there. What the hell is this place? That is a very good question, Gordon. Who are these people? What do you want, pig? Coming in here eyeballing me. You think you can police me? Nobody polices the Goliath. Oh, oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me! You are the police commissioner! Your face was on that billboard they replaced with mine! <laughs> what are you waiting for, old-timer? Johnny C doesn't do requests. Hmm, that looks like Johnny Charisma. We saw a, uh, a billboard with him in it in the beginning of the game, in the opening cutscene. Miss me already, Bats? Oh, it's you, Commissioner Boredom. What have you done with my soulmate? If you try to come between us, I'll carve you a smile so wide your head falls off. And she must be Christina Bell, who we saw a news report on uh, in the very beginning of the game. It's weird. Who's this guy? Commissioner, thank God. You have to get me out of here. They've locked me up, running tests like I'm some kind of... Guinea pig! There's nothing wrong with me! This guy we saw a, uh, a missing poster for also in the beginning of the game. That's weird. Now who's in here? Huh. Interesting. And now I don't remember what to do. Am I supposed to leave? Oh, God. Batman. I'm glad you came, Jim. 
You need to see this. What is this place? Who are these people? Before it killed him, Joker sent his infected blood out to all the hospitals in the state. I know. We tracked it all down. We missed some. How? Hospital errors. Transfusions that went unrecorded. Five people were affected. Untreated. The blood's gestated too long. It's altering them. They're becoming... Joker. My God. It's a form of Creutzfeldt-Jakob disease, but mutated beyond anything on medical record. What about that one? He doesn't look like the others. Henry Adams. He's been infected the longest, but he's symptomless. Immune to Joker's blood. I've got Robin running tests to find out why. One thing's for certain. Henry's the key to all this. I've cooperated. I've done everything you asked. You said it would only take a few days. You can't hold him here against his will. We're close, Jim. We can't let him go until we save the others. Wait. You said five. I only count four. There's one missing. He'll be here soon.